I'm Seth Troxler, and you're listening to Ibiza Live Radio. Well, it all began by going to a rave. <laughs> um, I went to a rave basically when I was 14, and I've been to a rave every weekend since. I guess my beginning in Ibiza on the island began with Circo Loco. The club had closed down. Um, they were looking for new residents. I had never even been to Ibiza, and I became the resident at DC10 in Circo Loco. That's been 13 years ago. And where is it going? I mean, it's like Charlie and the Chocolate Factory on the on the thing. It's like where it stops, nobody knows. I mean, I don't, I don't really know where the uh, where the ride ends, but I've been happy to be on the journey. I mean, I was the number one DJ a long time ago, so yeah. that was um, yeah. It's it's it's. <laughs> It seems like a distant memory, but I, I feel like I still got it. You know? I mean, it's looking back 12 years ago in my life, but I mean, it's a great accomplishment, but you can't set yourself in these accomplishments of your life, you know? I mean, I, I still think I'm one of the best goal scorers in the, in the league. You know, I'm still on the, on the, on the all star team. So it's, you know, but it's a you know, different time, different people, you know? But yeah, it's, it's cool. Yeah, um, well, I was saying this earlier, I did this panel and I don't really think about much. I kind of sit down and see what happens. I start playing with synthesizers, going through sounds, seeing where the sounds take me. It's uh, almost like using collage in a way. And I just kind of use that to take me to um, a place. Yeah, that's that's how I make it, you know? <laughs> I, don't, I don't really think about it so much. There's not like a, a large, incubation period before I make a song rather than like a sit down and and a fuck, a, fuck about I guess I think um, I kind of grew up in the in the farms you know I love the smell of cow shit um, <laughs> in the morning I really do um, but uh, I guess the, the thing about growing up in Detroit that's so incredible is the rich music history that the city offers and to be a part of that legacy later on has, has been an honor. But I think the real thing that's been incredible is just that growing up in a city that was so devoted to music and that, that changed my life. Uh, dogs, yeah, fuck cats. Um, I'm a vinyl guy, but USB because it's just easier. I'm lazy. Museum, obviously. Yeah. Sea or mountains? Ooh. I like to look at the sea, but I like to be in the mountains. Nightclubs. Yeah. Oh, sunrises are so much better than sunsets. A sunrise, you feel privileged because not everyone gets to see it. A sunset, it happens every day. If you were up to, to see a sunrise, it's a lucky occasion. I've got a whole new album from Also to Saturn. I've got a slew of new remixes. I just did a remix for Louis Vega. Um, God, I'm trying to put it all in my, in my mind. Louis Vega, Hercules Love Affair, uh, DJ Minx, um, that's some other stuff in there I forgot about already. <laughs> Look, well, the other day I, um, I was at the DC 10 closing and this uh, girl, a friend of mine, Sophia was in, she's from New York was in Ibiza the week prior, and I didn't know she had left. And there's other girl who looked almost identical to her. She looked fucking identical to her. I was at the club, so I roll up, and I give this girl this big hug, and this person's like, why are you touching me? And I was like, what? I was like, Sophia, and she's like, I'm not Sophia. And then I had to get my phone out to go to my Instagram to show her a picture of Sophia. And then her and her friends were like, okay, she, yeah, they, we actually do look alike. And I'm like, I'm telling you. Um, it's a picture of me and my son, and that's my life, yeah. I took that right before I left, we took him to the Berlin Zoo, and yeah, I'm very happy to be a father. So thank you so much, it's great talking to you. And Ibiza, I will see you later. Consider it done.